Okay, guys, let me just recap on what the fuck just happened. I was literally just doing this video. It's late at night, and I'm gonna just... It's fucking 2 a.m. Okay, let me just get my insult out the way before I do this again. Yes, um... Mini Clinton had did a reaction video on this. Yes, this video sucks. Music video at that. And this hobo glasses polo motherfucking pump hair fucking sock and sandals looking like you got him at a fucking wrist store. Dumbass looking fucking paparazzi naked piece of shit that probably makes porn videos with fucking celebrity bitches. Fucking take money across the fucking world, motherfucking dumb looking piece of shit. Somebody just do something about this guy. He needs to go. <laughs> at this point, I'll be completely honest. And I want to say go accusing me if something happened, but, you know, a lot of people might say I'm the king or fucking lord of karma. But that doesn't mean I'll do it. But, you know, if I'm being completely honest, I don't give two shits if this guy fucking died and went to hell. This person making a goddamn video, getting his dad in it, like he... I gotta say something about his dad. I gotta say something about his dad. I gotta say something about his dad. But his dad looking like he outside joining the video because he needs some goddamn like 50 year old bitches on his dick sucking it out dry. Fucking money wanting son of a fucking bitch looking like he came straight out of fucking FaZe's nightmare looking ugly ass motherfucker. I swear to God. <laughs> like. Somebody needs to do something about these fucking two. And the per to the person, like, this is a note. To the person that encouraged this motherfucker to make this video, you need to just quit your job. I don't care how much money you'll make. And you're going to find better used and better well spent money out of fucking Walmart that's forcing people to fucking screw boxes with fucking sex toys in them. Like, bruh, if you, bruh, if you don't get your dumb, encouraging motherfucking ass a fucking another job that's better than this shit, I swear to God, you need to do it. Like, everyone involved with this video needs to literally just go find a fucking life. <laughs> like, literally, just don't do this shit. Don't ever make a video like this again. And if it sucks, it's fucking bad. And not only that, but, um... See, I'm a guy that likes videos or music with fucking good length. But it can't be a shitty-ass video like this. Now, if you can make a good fucking rap song or something, or whatever the fuck you try to do with this... But, like, if you could make it fucking better, not like it came straight from the fucking world's largest fucking dump yard. Oh, the fucking human shit, dog shit, cat shit, bird shit goes with all the fucking cars that's been bird shitted on, bro. You know, if you can make a better video and maybe, like, fucking three minutes and... 40 to 50 seconds, maybe a little bit over four minutes. Y you know, I'd be glad to, like, support your shit. But, you know, uh, it can't be fucking shit-ass dumb shit like this. And I'll be completely honest. Please do not involve the word... 
whatever the fuck the word was. What the fuck was the word what? Uh, you know, let's just watch the video a bit, and we'll just find out what the fucking word was, because I forget all of a sudden. No. I swear to God, this fucking... Okay. What the fuck is that word? Yeah, I'm a... Let's just... Yeah. I just pulled up in that Lambo. I'm so hot, I need a fan, oh. Indiego in the sand, oh. Walk around in Gucci sand, oh. <laughs> Bruh, if you don't get those fake-ass Irish... Bruh, if you don't get those fucking thrift store sandals right out my fucking face right now, I'm about to throw those things deep in the fucking ocean that you're right beside right now, and you'll never find them. Next thing you know, if you swim out there, I'm gonna make sure you're the fucking next ocean's victim. Bro, look at this bitch. Look at the goddamn background behind him, too. Bro, this literally, this boy really pulled out a GTA 5 thinking he's all swagger. Boy, if you don't get your rock star drink looking ass out of my fucking face right now, thinking you fucking came out of GTA 5 with a fucking bunch of fucking nine year olds thinking you good, bruh. If. <laughs> bruh, if you don't. Bruh. Just seeing this video pisses me off. I don't fucking know why, but like. Bruh, if you don't get your ass out of San Andreas or whatever, bruh, looking like you came from fucking Nightmare Land version of fucking GTA 5, thinking you fucking are the monster that rules the fucking earth, bruh, you better get yourself a girlfriend that slaps you into the fucking next life you see. Because, like, bruh, if you don't... Bro, if you don't get your fake ass out of here, I swear to God, someone ought to sue your ass and make you never fucking, like, no, 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 not even that. Somebody need to sue your ass and put you in prison for the rest of your life so you never fucking make another YouTube video. I don't care about the fucking money you'd even make in prison. Fuck, I don't care. But, bruh, if you want to be this bad of a fucking human being, I might as well see your ass in the fucking next life. I don't even want to see your ugly ass shorts and shit, bruh. <laughs> bruh, look at these shorts. They fucking look like they were puked on by a clown and then a dog decided to come over and piss on them. And then bark at them. But not in a good way. Quite literally, like, mean bark and fucking growl at him because he fucking sucks that much. Like, bruh... You probably have life itself hating on you, because you probably don't do anything other than make cringy-ass videos that you fucking think are good, bruh. What kind of soundboard are you even using, too? Can I get on that? Bruh, I hate to burn you so much, but, like, what kind of music are you even using right now? It literally sounds like as if a fucking mouse... Like, not even that, but probably even, like, if Ratatouille had, like, an alternative version... Of fucking, <laughs> like, stepping on a fucking soundboard making random ass sounds. But, like, ra this Ratatouille ain't good at fucking making music. Like, bro, can I just get on the music of what the fuck you're even using here? Like, this shit sounds like you pulled a fucking, like, music box straight out of a fucking horror movie that came from a haunted goddamn police station or something. Like, bro, if you don't get your ugly, non-good ass, like, you probably have no girlfriend, bro. And if you do, she's probably just after your old goddamn money ain't even truthful to you, bro. Like, boy, if you don't get your fake ass out of here. Like, bro, I could cut you in half and literally do the same to me, and I would still outlive you because I'm fucking better than you, bro. Bruh, I could cut your head off and kill myself with a fucking pistol to the fucking head. And I would still live past you. Because you just fucking suck. 
fuck, my life would probably be better. I don't even know how to put this. Like, with, but also without you, Mr. Faze Rug. Whoever the fuck this is, I don't give a shit. But, like, even the name, even the name is enough to fucking roast, bruh. Like, Faze Rug? Faze Rug? Bruh, Faze Rug? Okay, you want to talk about phasing rugs. Okay, let's put it this way. Bruh, if I found me a phasing rug, it's going to phase right through me because it's so fucking dirty and terrible looking. Look like it came out of fucking world's largest pit of actual horse shit. Literally looking as if it fucking doesn't even exist. But like... You could clearly see it, but, like, thing is, it's gonna be phasing through you, like, bullets apparently phase straight through fucking Violet's goddamn shield and fucking Incredibles. Like, bruh, your dirty-ass rug probably gonna fucking be like, what kind of rug you even got that you wanna call yourself phase rug? Phase rug? <laughs> your ass better have a good-ass rug that's probably gonna be phasing through shit. Like, bruh, the only thing your rug's phasing is the fucking fact it's going straight through one ear and out the other. Like, bruh, even your name sucks. Even your name needs change, bruh. And you could just do that anytime you want, bruh. Like, bruh, bruh, no. Bruh, no. 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 Alright, alright. Let's just do this. Let's just do this. Bruh. Bruh, no, stop. Pause, bruh. Jeez. Okay, I apparently need to fix the freaking desktop audio because this shit ain't working. Like, bruh, where's my desktop audio? Where's my desktop audio, though? Get this shit on here. Yes, sir. There. Alright, 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 there. Alright. Sorry, what? Nah, pause. You've been what? Last time I checked. What? Hold up. Excuse me. Did you say you've been living life? Bro, you dumbass don't even probably know life if you don't even get your dumb dirty ass out the fucking gutter and dumpster you fucking came from, bro. You bitch ass probably came from like the fucking dimension that doesn't even have shit. Bro, your dirty ass look like it needs to go fucking kill itself. Bro, this video is enough to make me puke all over my monitor. I don't give two shits. But it's not gonna be because I'm disgusted of you. It's because I want you fucking dead. Literally, like, anything Face Rug does is probably fucking terrible. I'll be honest. Unless you can prove me wrong. So far, there's a lot of people, even including many Clint, that would probably want to fucking roast the entirety of Faze Rug. He's roasted multiple other people, too, that are famous. <laughs> like, bruh. If your ass don't actually go find a life, and I'm not talking about like, oh, nigga, go find a real life. Go find a real life. Go find a real life. Go find a life. You want to profit off this video? Because I'll tell you one thing. Probably half the freaking popularity of Earth ain't even paying your eyes. Well, freaking popularity of all your fucking life ain't paying. 
bro, you probably have all this shit in your house or something, or like either that or it's all just fucking rented, bro. Like your ass probably down the cheap lane just because you can't actually afford all this shit. How <laughs> much you want to bet that's true? Bruh, if you don't... Nah. 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 <laughs> this boy think he look clean, though. This boy look... Bruh, this boy think he look clean, though. This boy think he look clean, though. This boy think he look clean, though. <laughs> This boy look. <laughs> this boy think he look clean though. This boy think he got money. Bruh, this boy think he fucking good though. <laughs> oh, bruh, you don't get your dumbass logo and goddamn Mr. B shirt out my fucking face looking like you fucking suck Mr. B shirt. Just to fucking get that shirt. But like, not only that, but that shirt probably made of his fucking semen, bruh. Get that ugly ass Mr. B shirt out of my fucking face. I don't want to see it again. Literally looks like you made a fan-made fucking grandma-inspired Mr. B shirt. And decided to take it to a fucking homeschool dance at your goddamn high school. Boy looking like he came from the fucking 80s in a fucking dumbass dance shirt, bro. It don't even look snazzy, though. It don't even look snazzy. Bro, this boy really had his fucking dead grandma make that for him. Bro, bitch probably can't even see. Because it looks that bad, bro. This shit in real life probably pixelated. Probably had to fucking use CGI, bruh, to get that shirt. <laughs> Who you think you're fooling? Get your fake ass shit out of my face. Boy, really think. This boy really think. Bruh. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. No. This boy really think he good. This boy really think he's nazi. He got the shit. This boy out here thinking he's cool. But the only people think you cool is the fucking five year old kids that laughing at your shit like oh. Uh -huh. You know, I'm a big fan. I'm gonna suck your dick. But this boy, like, boy, you ain't get no pussy. Bro, you ain't get no pussy. You ain't got no fucking dick, bro. You ain't good. You ain't snazzy like that. Boy can't probably even afford a goddamn strip club. Bro, even look at these trees, bro. Looking like they came literally out of GTA 5. Not only that, but like, look at the quality at the bottom until it practically reaches the top, bro. This boy really pulling GTA 5 shit. Most of this... Probably ain't even real life scenery. It's probably just fucking green screen magic pulled on fucking GTA 5. I'll be completely honest, probably the fucking vehicles himself are fake. He probably just built some like plastic models and shit. Like, okay, because I, here, do you ever realize how people make these YouTube videos or like music videos, right? They don't even show you the inside. They don't even show you the inside. And I'll tell you one thing. If they ever do show you the inside, here's the fact. That shit on the inside 
tries to look realistic, but there's always going to be that one small little fucking thing that you'll notice that just cuts it all off. Do you know how forgery works? Do you know how forgery works? It's like a fake dollar bill. If you have a real dollar bill and a fake dollar bill, if you put a fake dollar bill under a light, there's going to be that text that is invisible because it's inside the dollar bill or maybe even invisible ink of some sorts. Forgery is exactly like that. Problem is, is that if they try to build a fake car or something out of cheap parts, you're going to be able to tell because the, even if they did show the inside, there's going to be a mistake. There's going to be a fucking mistake. It might even be a big one. You might just notice right off the bat. So, you know what? This is like a reaction video. Like, you know, like a, uh, whatever you want to fucking call it. But also at the same time, fucking, I'm fucking exposing the motherfucker. Like, bruh, you ain't got this shit. You ain't never gonna have this shit. Not one thing for sure, people like me ain't ever gonna fucking be on your side. Even if you did get rich and have all this shit. Bro, your, your fake ass needs to get out of here. Go to the fucking world you came from, bro. You fake as fuck. Bro, you're so fake, you fucking look like you came from a knockoff anime realm, bro. All animes are better than your ass, even Pokemon. Pokemon probably made more money than you. Bruh, if Google got sued, they'd still make more money than your fake ass. If Apple got sued, and I'm not saying I'm with Apple, bruh, everybody that, like, makes fun of Apple and shit have, like, Apple products and even Apple phones and shit. So, like, they're Apple fans. But I'm serious when I say, like, I've got this, like, fucking Samsung phone, bruh. Fucking Samsung. Like, when I say this boy as fake as Apple, I mean that truthfully. But, like, here's the thing. I'm still not on Apple's side, but when I say if Apple went fucking bankrupt, they'd still make more money than this fake bitch. He's probably filming this on his iPhone and shit, too. That's double fake. Boy, this double fake. Fucking bitch needs to get back to the planet he came from. Bro, probably look. Bro, the Martians are probably looking for him. <laughs> this boy probably came from Mars. <laughs> this boy came from the realm of Phineas and Ferb when the fucking Martians or something came over. This boy looking as fake as Candace. And I'll be honest, he's saying he's wearing all his Gucci shit. But like, little kids ain't even probably know that though. They probably don't even care. They probably just think this bitch is hot. Like, bro, they probably just think this bitch is fucking good. Nah. This bitch probably takes money from little fucking children that donated all their fucking money on their birthday. Nonetheless, probably fucking accepts all the fucking money grown-ups give him because they like him or something like that. Whoever fucking would, though, if they're fucking adult. But, like, bruh, if there's, like, one adult or something out there that fucking likes this fucking guy or, like, this fucking crew or whatever... Phase club or whatever. I don't give two shits. But like, bruh. If there's like an adult out there, this this is the kind of, bruh, this kind of, this, this is the kind of motherfucker that literally 
fucking has that person donate all their freaking money ever. They don't even have, like, money to, like, then get groceries, pay for their house. They probably don't go home with. And this boy would walk away from it. He'd gladly accept it, being like, oh, okay, thank you. Just make me even more rich. Uh, boy, someone needs to lock this guy up and let him die. Boy. He's like the corrupt version of Spider-Man. But not even that, because, like, there was that Spider-Man time when he turned, like, into the Venom Spider-Man. Like, it got on his suit and everything, then eventually Spider-Man did, like, <clears throat> control it, and he made his own suit out of it. But, like, and I'll be honest, I wish they'd bring back the actual, like, classic, uh, black suit. Because, like, the classic, uh, black web suit is fucking cool. I think that shit's dope. Like, that, that suit's awesome. You can't replace that. Like, that suit's all, just amazing, I'll be honest. I wish they could bring out a video game, like, around this time. Kind of like the, uh, PS4 Spider-Man game. But, like, I want them to, like, include the actual, um, webbed black Spider-Man suit. Because that, that fucking, sh I'll be honest, that fucking Spider-Man suit is straight fire. Can't replace it. That that suit's awesome. But, like, my point is, let me not get off track. M let me not get off track. This boy more corrupted than the fucking Venom Spider-Man. <laughs> this boy more corrupted than Thanos. This, pro this boy probably, like, snap his fingers and he ain't gonna wipe out the population or something. Nah. This boy gonna erase the entire existence except for him. And the reason I say that is because everyone in the right mind would probably wish they'd just be able to get away from this bitch. Bruh, everyone in the right mind would probably just wish to fucking already be out of this dumbass sight. Like, they probably just wish they never saw this motherfucker. Like... <laughs> If there was a Thanos out there, get me away from this. Like, get me away from this. Like, I no wanna like, I no longer wanna see this reality as what I live in. Bro, this crap going down though. Uh, and like, this video is only a small fucking percentage of it. <laughs> Even those fucking buttons look like, like they came from the dollar store. <laughs> and he sewed them on probably with the most cheapest ass thread. That's probably the reason he doesn't have a button. Because he didn't even have the hole for it. Boy got himself some fake ass shirt. Mr. Beast logo on it, bruh. Get your ugly chest hairs out of my face. Bruh, that shit needs to be shaved more. Matter of fact, I'll be honest, there's nothing there. But that's the point. I don't want nothing to be there. <laughs> I don't even want him there. I don't even want him there. I don't care about no hair or hairs he has on him. In all honesty, I don't want him there. I don't want to see him right now. That's how bad this motherfucker is. I don't even want to see him. I don't. <laughs> Like, you know, like, hell, fuck it, you know? If this boy want to fuck up his future, I don't care, go ahead. Have the fucking future turn on you, bro, because that's right where you headed, bro. That's right where you going. Let's just go, let's just go, let's just go. Nah. No, 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 there you are, there you are. The word Liddy, Manny Clint in his video literally had said that anybody that uses the word Liddy, but actually Manny Clint specifically said anybody who used the word Liddy on YouTube 
should get demonetized. In my honest opinion, I think anybody that uses the word, um, Liddy in their life should be demonetized on YouTube if they have an account. And not only that, but if they're going to make an account or if they want to one point in their life go on to YouTube or have a account for Google or something, they should instantly be banned from any Google operating platform. End of story. And if it goes too far, take them to jail and never let them out. Because the word is just a pity. The word's annoying. Hearing the word makes me cringe to the point I wish I had a pistol in my hand and want to shoot myself right now. And lastly, the word... I feel like it's kind of a mistake. Bro, look at his arm! Bro, look at his arm! Bro! <laughs> Bro, look at his arm! What happened to your arm? Bro, what happened to your arm? Bro! Bro, did I catch you at a bad time, bro? What happened to your arm? Bro, what happened to your arm? Nobody's arm shaped like that. Not even mine. And mine are actually like malformed too. Like they always have been. I was born like that. But like, not even my arms look like that. This boy looked like he got in a car crash and his arm bent the opposite way it's supposed to. And somehow, this boy still think it look good. <laughs> This boy look like something that'd visit me in my nightmares! <laughs> Bro, look at these shirts and stuff, though. Probably he even regrets making this video. Probably he even look at him himself like, What is my life? I know one thing, if I were in his shoes right now, I'd rather just go end my career right then and there. I'd go find a real job other than doing YouTube videos for money, just stealing people. Fucking cash grab, motherfucker. Like, it's like a lot of people on Roblox. Like, all their game passes and shit cost, like, what? Like, over fucking $2,000 or, like, not over $2,000. Like, 2,000 Robux or, like, fucking over 800 Robux and shit. Like, boy, you ain't fucking with me like that. And not only that, but, like, there's tons of games that have, like, multiple of their game passes expensive unnecessarily. Like, this is this kind of, this is this bitch right here. This, this is him. This, this is the representation, reputa representation of that. Lil' crass grab motherfucker with a deformed arm. His arm probably looked like that because he was going too fat to Lambo and he probably had fucking death at first sight, but somehow he came back to life in an uglier body. Bruh, bruh really incarnated himself in a fucking uglier fucking body looking like he came from the goddamn death ocean looking like he came out like a monster. Bruh, look at the pimple on it, like... Look at that ugly ass spot on his face, though. Look at how he looks. He looked like he smoked weed earlier. He literally looked like he hit the jack. <laughs> That's probably why he's making this video. He probably drunk or high as fuck. This boy gotta kill himself. And hell, with that Lambo real though, like this boy really gonna kill himself. <laughs> Like, you shouldn't get yourself high while driving, especially if you're getting yourself drunk at the same time, and there's people who actually do that. But, bruh, if you don't get your un-kid-friendly ass out of here, like, literally, this stuff is supposed to be subject towards kids, too. Like, how are you gonna tell me this is, this shit's for kids when this motherfucker looked like he about to go off and murder someone? 
Just look at his fucking eyes, though. <laughs> Looking like he's piercing right through you. Bro, look at his arm, his fucking eyes, bro. Look at his dumbass smile. His fucking ears look like a fucking creepy-ass version of Dumbo. And boy, really look like he's, like, fucking nightmare fuel Dumbo version. Like, bro. Hey, if you don't know who Dumbo is, bro, you ain't living. Like, you can't go one time in your life where you haven't at least tried to learn about retro stuff or, like, old-time stuff. Like, I love classic cars. You know, modern-day cars can't beat classic cars. I mean, I'll be honest. Classic cars are cool. But, you know, um... It's just kind of like that. Like, hell, if you don't get most references or, like, characters and shit, I swear, something needs to change about you. Because... <laughs> You know, there's a lot of people in the world who would gladly tell you about, like, these characters and stuff. And, like, if you've never heard of them, like, not even a small conversation or something, I don't even know, bro. You live in some weird dimension where you just don't know shit. And we're like, I swear to God, though. Um, I'll be completely honest, like, this song literally just repeats itself. Probably not too long from now. Well, let's just find out. Oh, what a long, yeah. Long day. Yeah. Woo. Are you tired? Yes, he's tired. Yeah, he's tired. Don't make him do it again. Don't make him do it again. Matter of fact, after this video, don't ever do another music like video like this again. Ever. Don't ever do it. Fucking bad. Motherfucker, like, don't do music videos like this. This shit bad. This shit bad. So bad, it really does make me either want to commit suicide, puke, and or run out the house, run to the woods or something, and never be found again in my life. It'd make me just want to disappear for the rest of my life. Never looking back. And just taking the time to forget about this shit. And maybe even die. Knowing that I wanted to forget about this shit. This shit might just stay in my life forever. Whether I'm alive or a fucking ghost. Because this shit is that bad. This shit is that bad. To the point where it might not even leave me. It's just a living fucking nightmare. This boy is a living nightmare. This boy needs to put on some sleeves. Can we roll back a little bit? Bruh. Let's roll back a little bit, bruh. Look. Look. What is wrong with your arm, bruh? What, whose nightmare did you roll out of? Why you look high like you're gonna kill someone? Not only that... You probably did kill someone! That arm is probably like a fucking like fake arm, or like, not even fake, but like a real person's fucking arm. You probably sawed off and just like, you know, like, cleverly putting your actual arm where it can't be seen, and then literally holding this arm in place. Like, yo bitch ass literally looked like you just murdered someone, and then came into the scene. Yo, bitch ass need to go get some help, including anyone who's related to this video. I don't care if that other guy was your dad, whoever the fuck it was that literally looked like he never got pussy in his life, and then, as well as never went to a fucking dance before, bruh, needs to literally go get his, a life himself, and probably some therapy. Like, you, specifically, man, need to go grab some therapy. Your allegedly dad, bruh, needs to go grab some therapy with you. And the goddamn cameraman who inspired this little poor bitch of a guy to do this shit needs to go with you both. All three of you need some fucking lessons in your life, bruh. Where'd your shit go wrong? To the point where you don't even do this one minute part. 
But then, after that relaxing session, nah, nah, nah. Do the second verse. Nah, nah. Are you tired, man? Bro, I'm so tired, but we killed that. Yeah, hell yeah. But bro, we have to do the the second verse. Second verse is the same. There is no second verse. There is no second verse. They literally just do the same lyrics. No joke. The same lyrics. Different background, just a different way. Not even probably a different way, probably the exact same way. Just different background and different themes. Or whatever the fuck you want to call it. I guess it's the same thing, but like, bro, just, just watch. Whoever this cameraman -y is, don't ever help anybody within the phase community with a video ever again in your life. You need to go find yourself a fucking horror movie that'll hire you and get the shit scared out of you. Because, like, that's probably what you need to realize what your fucking life is, bruh. And what you're fucking doing right now. Whoever this cameraman is really needs to go fucking, like, do some other shit, you know? Take a vacation. Like, don't ever make shit like this again. Go take a vacation and think about a few things, and then, if you were in the right mind after, then you know not to do shit like this again, for nobody. Nobody. Go get yourself an actual, real, good-ass production job. If you think you're making good money off of this, nah. Bro, your, your paycheck needs to be cut, and I'm not talking about these phase community that hired you, your paycheck need to actually be cut from the bank or something. Like, whatever you're being paid with literally needs to be called in by the bank or something and either shredded or just cut. Because they cut credit cards in half. So, like, you need to just get your old fucking crusty-ass paycheck canceled. Because, like, bruh, I would not... If... Here's the thing, like... If I were hiring someone to do a music video on me, and I paid them, maybe periodically through it, for certain things or whatever, I'm not paying them for something like this. This is actual trash. This idea probably got pulled out the dumpster and it's like, what's this? Something I can do a music video on? Really? Wow! 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 This is such a good idea. This is literally dog shit. A doggy bag of dog shit. Shaking in the palm of his hand. That was the inspiration and idea. Get this doggy, filthy, fucking need a shower, fake ass motherfucker out of my face. Get him away. Nobody needed him on this earth. No, Nobody needed him on this earth just to do this. Nobody. <laughs> nobody. 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 Needed him to ever make this. And whoever even was asking for this or something. Bro, I hope you have the most worst nightmare about this shit. And I hope it scars you for the rest of your life. And I'm talking about every single fucking person and individual that actually wanted this. And actually like this. Not only that, but like, bro, can we take a moment to like look at the dislikes or something? Bro, where are those dislikes? 40,000 dislikes. Bro, 40,000 dislikes? I'll highly admit, they deserve that. They deserve every dislike that is right there. They deserve every one. And if I could get, like, a schematic or something with this pulled up, if it would show me, bruh, yeah, no. Nah. Nope. Nah. No, 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 no. I'm serious. They deserve every dislike that is right there. 
yeah. The like percentage is very, very high. Way more higher than the dislike. But 40,000 people is a lot more people than I can count for. If you go on a lot of Roblox games, not even actual good Roblox games will get a ton of likes like this compared to dislikes. Dislikes will still probably have a ton of people. There's an actual good game I know that has a ton of dislikes. But still very high likes. But the reason for that is is because it's it's literally acceptable. It's reasonable. It's understandable. Like every dislike has to be for a reason. And if it's not really for a reason, then it's probably just someone trying to troll or something like Albert. Let's be honest, there's a lot of people in the world that take after his footsteps, which really shouldn't. It just makes the world more rotten. Just makes Earth more terrible. But this is also something you should never do. Ever. Not ever. I don't care if you're a trolling person, and I don't care if you were someone that fall, you know, follows in Alberts or Flamingos. Steps. I don't care. The one thing that you should never do is if you realize you're making Earth a more terrible place, is just don't do that. Maybe try to reflect on your life and maybe fucking make it better. I would rather not see the Earth explode and reappear just to restart itself and then have a better cycle. All because people wanted to make the earth explode. Because they fucked up. I'd rather not see that. But in the current road we're going, that's kind of how it's leading. No doubt about it. Oh well, we're all doomed. Blame the people. Blame Earth's population. Because at this point, that's where it came from. And that's where it's staying. And then Earth's going to fail on itself and have probably a lot of ways the Earth could go down. And well, you guessed it, Earth is only going to reappear and be started all over again. And hopefully, maybe we'll go on a better path. Maybe. Maybe. If the human race decides to actually notice what the fuck they're doing. I don't know. I guess we'll see. But in the current road, it's going, well... I'll be completely honest. It's going down the path of which this fucking music video was created. Yeah, I just said that. Because then again, this music video was created from an idea from a fucking dumpster that had a doggy bag in it full of dog shit. Yeah. That's the world we're currently living in. And it's only getting worse. Proof. Just watch. Come on, bro. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna just do a little bit of commentary, because, at the end of this, because, like, yeah. Just the same shit all over again. Not only that, but this bitch really pulled his dad into this shit. Bruh, no, no, no. Just look at what I mean. Bruh, this boy, look. Messed up as fuck. Nah, no, 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 no. Let's go. Let's go back a bit. Let Let's go back a bit on that. Bro, look at his bitch ass dancing. Bro, 
You could just tell this bitch really be doing this because he wants a goddamn 50-year-old on his dick. This boy probably ain't got a dick. <laughs> Bruh. Not only that, but like, this Gucci clothing? How much you want to bet it's not even real? It's probably just fucking homemade, bro. They probably just, like, took some Gucci logos and put it on a shirt. How much you want to bet they probably got, like, um... How much you want to bet they actually, like... They quite literally probably, like, after making this video... They probably literally just, like... Got a paycheck. Or, like, uh, not a paycheck, but, like, they, they got a check in. From Gucci themselves. Wanting money because they decided to fraud their clothing. Yeah. I'm willing to bet that happened. But oh well, they're rich. They will get through it. Right? Uh, no. I wouldn't be surprised if their asses got sued. I really wouldn't be. It's highly likely from bitches like this. Yeah. Um Yeah, this this is basically it. So I'm ending the video here. So um yeah. Enjoy my insults or whatever. And I'll put a link to Mini Clin, you know, I'll put a link to Mini Clin's video in the description. Yeah. Um see you in the next video everyone. Bye.